All right, so I have something here today that I wanted to review. I've been like on this kick that I've really wanted to get like a Fitbit or like something like that. And so I went into Walmart and I decided to look at the 3 Plus series. Um, and I was like, I want something kind of cute, something that I can adjust. Um, and so on their website, I seen that they had a 3 Plus light tracker. Um, I believe that's what this one is called. There was like three that I looked at. I'm going to bring up three plus light. I just want to do a little bit of research while we're sitting here talking about it. So, um, yes, here it is. It was $29.88. You can get it in black or pink. Um, I want to go to like the legit like review of them. Um, let's see. Okay, so here's something. Okay, so basically it's got a little power button on the top here. And you click it and it tells you what time it is. Um, oh, it's upside down. Um, it tells you the date. It tells you the time. Um, and it tells you your battery. Um, if you click it again here, um, it will tell you um, how many steps you've walked. It will tell you, um, this one is miles, so for 0.47 miles. I've burned 51 calories, and then if you click it back, it, um, it goes, you know, back to its original screen. Sorry, I'm, I have a pop socket here that's supposed to be my friend, but it's not working. Um, but yeah, uh, also what's cool about this one is... Um, the little charger is on the back here, so this little thing just kind of like clips over and then you just like plug it into your car or your computer. I actually charged this with my computer last night, um, so I'm kind of curious to see how well the battery lasts. Um, another thing that's cool with this is when you get a phone call or a text, um, there will be a little message symbol that pops up here. Um, it will tell you how many text messages you have. Um, and then you could click through. Now, the only issue that I'm having with this is when I'm clicking through it to read the, the text messages, it doesn't show the first one and go like, say I got three. It doesn't show the first one and then go all the way to the third one. It only reads me the third one. Um, but it shows me and it vibrates and it, and it lets you know that you have messages. And then if you're getting a phone call, um, the name of the person will appear, a phone will appear, and it will vibrate like a phone. It will go, and it will vibrate while it's on your wrist to let you know you're getting a call. And so what I think is pretty cool is, you know, not only does it tell you calories burned and steps taken, but, um, you know, since it, like, shows you that, you know, someone's calling, I thought that was pretty cool. Um, the only thing that it doesn't include is like with some of the other smart watches and all that, um, they take heart rate. Um, that's one thing that it does not have. So it does not take heart rate. Um, it sits pretty comfortably on the wrist. There's different adjustments. It just kind of clips in. There's like a little metal pin here that you just kind of like push into like whatever like setting you want there. And then, you know, it's pretty comfortable. Um, I have it to, to have the time basically this way. Um, so one thing here, um, on their website here, it shows that they have, um, the pink and the black. And as you flip through the pictures, it just kind of, it's kind of the same there. So here's the pink and here's the black. Um, it's got 25 reviews and it's only got three stars. Now, the only reason that I can think that it only has three stars is because there's not a lot to it. It's not like a, um, you know, like Fitbit or it's not like a really fancy one. Um, it says the three plus light tracks steps taken, calories burned, distance traveled, duration of sleep and sleep cycles. It even has daily life reminders such as when to wake up or take your medicine and a variety of smartphone applications. The device is also dust proof and water resistant so you can wear it wherever you go. So that was one of the things that I had set up last night was um, I went on the app and I set up a reminder to take my metformin. I set up a reminder to um, um, to get up and like stuff like that. And you can either set a sleep schedule on it 
or what you can do is you can hold the button down for three seconds and it will actually go into sleep mode. Um, this one says, the new designed light. To get on track to body confidence, you need to track your steps, calories burned, distance traveled, sleep duration, and sleep cycles. The 3 Plus Life Light Fitness Tracker does all that and more. You're smart. You've looked around and you know that other fitness trackers cost anywhere between $20 and $150. If the only thing the 3 Plus Light Fitness Tracker did was to finally get you walking more and sleeping better, what would be worth what would it be worth to you? Hundreds of dollars, right? Well, obviously you are in the right place. So it's been pretty good so far. I definitely want to, you know, take some time and, you know, kind of see how decent it is. Um, it's got an OLED display, it says. It's got a TICC2540 SOC processor with 4.0 Bluetooth. Um, it's got plus three axis accelerometer sensors, controls and buttons, um, charges fully in two hours, up to seven days of battery life, and three to five days of continuous use. Um, it was the band, the charging cable, and cradle, quick start guide, warranty, insert, and full instruction manual. So some of these... Um, some of these reviews, I do kind of want to go over the reviews. Um, this one says, you get what you pay for. It's one star. And it says, I should have saved my money and bought a Fitbit. I bought this on February 20th, 2019 at Walmart. The battery is already starting to look like it's not going to hold up well. It seems to register steps when I am sitting. I guess a slight movement of my hand registers as a step. Since the box says, do not return to store, I guess Walmart can't take back this piece of crap. Um, doesn't track steps correctly, bought this watch today, was super excited, I do a lot of cardio at the gym, and wanted to use my phone to watch TV, so if I'm not holding my phone, I can't count my steps. Well, thought this would help, and I was wrong. If I even clean my ear with a Q-tip, it counts it as steps, and I'm not even moving, so I think I'll just put it on when I work out and not for anything else, waste of money. This person says, the 3 Plus Light Activity Tracker is amazing and programs beautifully. It's a small watch, but when jogging every afternoon, this baby keeps track of the number of steps I take each day and the number of calories I've burned each day. That's why I bought this little guy for $32. Dust and waterproof protection material is an A plus rating. I'm so glad I bought this piece of tech that keeps track of my body. Um, that is one thing that I've found as an issue with this though, is, um, when I'm trying to sync it to my phone, um, sometimes it won't sync the Bluetooth to my phone. And so, um, so if I come over here, press the button on the side, it shows that I have a message and then you tap it again. And it will say what the message said. So, I have given the Light Activity Tracker 3 Plus, I've given it a week. And I'm not impressed. Um, I mean, for $39, it's definitely what you're going to get out of it. Um, it's been decent. It's just, it does not track steps accurately. Um... That's the one thing, like, I could sit here and shake it around, and that's just the issue, is it's counting me shaking it around. So, um, it shows right here that I have two messages, um, and then what's cool about this, I mean, if, if I didn't want to get a better one, like, just to have, like, a basic one that's going to tell me, like, time and all that, and messages, I would keep this one. So, like, it's telling me I have two messages, and then I click, and it says... Um, let me try to switch camera here. So it says from Naomi, she did a smiley face. And then like, there's the time. There's my steps today. I've gone 3.23 miles. I've burned 365 calories and then back to the time. Um, I thought it would have been a little better. Um, so in the box included is little holster for it I don't even know how the heck you shut this thing off because if you hold the button down it says that it's going into sleep mode basically so it comes out of the box all like kind of like wrapped up tight so we'll put this back in there 
And then what comes in the box is you have a little instruction pamphlet here that talks about how you do everything, um, how to set the time up, but like to set the time up, basically, um, you have to basically hook it up to your phone. Like it has to be hooked to your phone for it to catch the time and stuff. There is no way to set the time on it, um, itself. It has to be Bluetooth hooked up. It shows you how the charger hooks up and all that stuff. So there's this, um, there's a one year warranty, um, on here. Um, there's a... Do not return product to store. I've heard a couple people say that um, on in their reviews that it says, so I'm kind of curious to see if Walmart's actually going to take it back. Um, that's one thing that someone complained about. And then uh, it just kind of goes through like what Androids it could be used with, which is weird because I have a Motorola and it's not even on the list. But it talks about that, and then it shows, like, what the app looks like when you sign up on it. So, it's got some good information on it. It's magnetic. It's got magnets. So, yep, it's got magnets. But this is what the front of the box looks like. And then when you open it, um, it says, open me. It's magnetic. When you open it, it had the thing in there. So, um... What's cool is on the app, you can set up goals that you want to achieve, like stepping wise. Um, you can set up a goal on there. And so it vibrates and it says goal achieved and it has a thumbs up. Um, when you get a, it vibrates. So when you get a, um, a call too, like it will actually vibrate that your call is coming in, um, which I thought that was pretty cool. Um, come on, come out of there. I'm like beating it up in the video. Um, but, uh, it vibrates for text messages that come in. Um, it vibrates when you're supposed to take medicine. Like, you could set reminders. Um, it vibrates, um, for timers when you're supposed to wake up. And then you can put it in a manual sleep mode. Um, or it can automatically, like, just go into sleep mode if you, like, set a time that, that you want to, um, to have it set for, for sleep. Um, and it tracks your sleep and stuff. So, it's decent for $30. It's decent. But do I want a better one? Yes. I want to get one that can actually, like, track heart rate because this one doesn't. And I want to get one that accurately counts my steps. So I'm probably going to move up to, like, a Fitbit or something. But this is my review for the fitness tracker. And if you want something cheap and you want something that's good, I would get it. If you're okay with this being cheap and you're okay with, like, you know, it just kind of getting the job done, this would be for you as a starter one. So that's my review. What do we say at the end of a video? Leave a comment down below and ring the bell. I hope you like this channel. So subscribe to our channel and bye. Bye.